Today guys, I bring you this amazing legendary farm. A new legendary farm that arrived with the Muxis heist of the handsome jackpot. This means you can land most if not all of the new legendaries from this spot. And it drops lows. There are low, absolutely tons of legendaries that drop here, people per run. It's crazy. How's it going, guys? My name is DPJ, and today I'll bring you another Borderlands 3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like it really helps out. And subscribe if you want to see more. On screen now, you can see my weekly giveaway along with last week's winner. To be in with a chance of winning this yourself, simply make sure you are subbed to this channel and have notifications turned on. Drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so this legendary farm requires you to have almost completed DLC 1 and the story campaign it offers. If you haven't done this yet, spoilers definitely lay ahead within this video. So if you don't want to be spoiled, if you don't want the story to be spoiled, turn away now and come back when you've completed the DLC. So this farm is of Freddy, a boss who is super easy to kill. And what's amazing about this is people, you don't have to quit out and load it back up. It also means you can use many of the glitches that still work in game, which allow you to stack damage and so forth. So you can literally one shot this dude to make it even easier and more efficient. Now glitches you will find linked within the video description via a video of five glitches that still work. Check that out. So Freddy is located within the VIP tower entrance, so load in here and simply just run forward. Now if he ain't spawned in, simply kill a few robots and then he will spawn in. Ah. And then just kill him. Once you have killed him, he drops many legendaries by the way. And then all you have to do people is fast travel back to the start and run back here. Doing this 9 times out of 10, 99 times out of 100. He will be back ready for you to kill again. If he ain't, go ahead and kill a couple of robots and then he will spawn back in. Now all of these legendaries you can see on screen now I got in probably under 10 minutes as it's that easy. And like I said, you can use those damage glitches to one shot him if you need to make it easier and more efficient for yourself. Now once you've killed him, like I said, simply fast travel back to the start of this area and rinse and repeat using those vending machines to restock that ammo. Now this is by far the quickest way to farm those new legendaries. Old ones do drop here too. And I will say I do believe he's the go to boss now for the auto aim sniper rifle new to this DLC. Now I did have a few of the other new legendaries drop here so I'm guessing most do. So yes guys have fun with this and farm away. On that note, we have come to the end. If you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video, I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.